Dear Diary, today I went to the park with Grandpa. There were tall trees, small shrubs, birds, and my favorite butterflies everywhere. Grandpa told me that this is why Singapore is a uh, um a city in nature. But my friends told me Singapore is called a city in a garden. Well, they're not wrong, you know. Singapore's greening journey started when we were planting trees all around the island for shade. And soon, parks and gardens were built very quickly for everybody to enjoy. So Singapore grew from a garden city to a city in a garden. Just like the way you grow. <laughs> soon, Singapore will grow to be a city in nature. More trees will be grown and there'll be more nature play gardens and therapeutic gardens as well. Now this means that more homes and habitats will be created for the animals that you find in your books. Then I can see birds and butterflies more often now. Yeah, exactly, right? <laughs> Simple air. Oh, Grandpa has got many stories with this plant. <laughs> ah, let's take a picture with this plant, shall we? Okay. Grandpa always says the same thing when he sees these plants. Then again, I always pose whenever I see flowers too. Then suddenly, we heard lots of rustling in the leaves. There were... Hornbills! These big birds, they built their home in natural tree holes. Making green spaces like this very crucial for them. Let's go look. We were living so close to so many interesting animals and plants. But of course, we kept our distance and did not feed the creatures, so we would not frighten them or disrupt their natural eating habits. While I had lots of fun, the sun was really bright and I was getting really hot and tired. Luckily, there's Grandpa's eyes watering in the shade of the tree. Oh. I love how the trees shade us from the heat and keep us cool. Along with other plants, they help us fight climate change. They're also planted by the side of the roads. It creates nature ways for animals to move from one area to another easier. In addition to also providing food sources for them, trees provide our vehicles with better shade and also fresher air for us to breathe. They make Singapore a much prettier and better place to live in. Yes. On that note, let's go check our garden and see how it's doing. Shall we? Okay. May, do you know planting your own plant is a great way for us to contribute to Singapore being a city in Asia? Of course. Plus, this is the only way I can get my hands dirty without mummy scolding me. <laughs> Looks like you're putting Ann Park's plant starter kit into good use, huh? Wow! <laughs> well, since you're pretty much done up, let's go get wash up. And remember, your plant journal, okay? Okay. After today's walk, I decided I'm going to play my part in helping Singapore become a city in nature. I can take part in the One Million Trees movement and plant a tree with Grandpa. Or I can become a citizen scientist and count the birds and butterflies in the park. When I'm older, I could even become a youth steward for nature. There is so much we can do. Anyway, update soon. Love, Mary.